and let the puzzle begin. So as you all know, we've had some fuel problems. This is after, oh, probably 20 hours in rough sea. This is what I got out of the uh, bowl and the lines are clogged. So I am putting together a system to try and clean it out the best it can while I'm in quarantine until uh, I can get somewhere where I can have it professionally polished. But anyways, let the puzzle begin. Dug through some parts, I found some connectors, my old uh, filter, and uh, there was an actual motor on here from the previous owner. So wish me luck, I'll keep you updated on the, uh, on how it works out. Okay, so I showed you the puzzle. Um, for the fuel polishing system. So let me show you what I came up with. This is not a permanent install, so, but it, it is doing the trick for now. And now that I know that it works, I will work on a permanent install for it. Uh, so these tanks have an extra inlet or outlet uh, on the bottom of the tank, at the very bottom. So I'm drawing the fuel from the bottom of the tank and taking it over and it goes up to the filter, gets sucked through the filter to the motor that was left over on board. And of course, all these fittings I, I just had uh, and it just comes out of the pump and returns into the top of the uh, into the top of the tank. So you know it's a temporary install, and uh, you're faced with some challenges. You work with the resources that you have, especially during this lockdown period, and you'll be surprised in the solutions uh, that you can come up with. And uh, I'll keep you tuned on the progress, uh, but for now, I am going to filter this fuel and start with that. Okay, so that's what the starboard tank looks like after a two-day run. And uh, I've already talked about the problems in the port tank. I showed you the get up, the uh, polishing system. This is the bowl after not even an hour of running. So I'm gonna change the filter in it. Looks like I'm gonna go through a lot of filters. Uh, but, so, rather deal with that here at the anchorage than uh, out at sea like I had to. Clean. Dirty. Until we can get it professionally cleaned. Yeah, until we can get it professionally cleaned. I, I've mentioned that before. But you got to work with what you've got, with the challenges you have uh, when locked down in quarantine. So, again, I'll reiterate, this is the best I can do with the parts that I've got. All right, I am so excited. I finally figured out what it was. So it wasn't the filters. What happened was, oh, this is the manifold. This one takes it over to the uh, port filters, but it comes from the tank to the manifold, from the manifold up to the filters. And I was trying to fill the filters and they weren't filling. So I was just working my way backwards through the system. Uh, disconnected this, obviously had the valve closed, put a jug under, opened up the valve and nothing came out. So I jammed a screwdriver up in there, cleaned it out, put diesel into there, tried it again. The hose then was clogged, so I took the air compressor, because everybody has an air compressor on the boat, blew out the hose, and uh, now we are sucking the fuel through. I'm gonna run it through the, this is not a permanent install by any means, um, but this is the fuel polishing system I put together with what I had on board. So, problem solved. We should be firing up the engines uh, shortly. I just wanna, run that through a bit. Anyways, wish me luck. Is this the moment of truth, Captain? Moment of truth. Let's just check all valves are open. Make sure the valves are open. Valves are open. All right, let's give it a go. <laughs> all right. Moment of truth, everybody. 